Good morning, everyone. Today we are going to Cushing Memorial Park for a walk and activity. So you're gonna need a paper, lined paper, and pencil for this activity. And now, if you would like to, to go to the website for Cushing, um, there isn't a lot of helpful information on there because this park, you don't need a map or anything. There's no trails, it's very man-made, it's paved and all that. So go ahead and go to the website if you would like. If not, I will see you in the car. All right, so while I'm opening this, let's hit some facts about the park. So Cushing Memorial Park is 67.5 acres big. And on those 67.5 acres, you'll find picnic benches, normal benches, um, a playground. You'll find a playground there. It's called Children's Grove Playground. You'll find paved pathways, um, meadows, gardens, and some nice shade trees. Now, history about the park. Uh, Cushing Memorial Park during World War II actually used to be a military hospital that specialized in neuroscience and neurosurgery. That is surgery and science and medicine for the brain. After its days as a military hospital, it was converted into a space for geriatric care and geriatric research. That is research and care specialized for the elderly. Now, because of its days as a military hospital and as a space for geriatric care and research, it was its floor plan it's all its gardens meadows its pathways are all preserved from those from those times and you can see them now today so as you walk the park you can actually feel the history um fun facts out of the way enough talk let's hit the park welcome to cushing memorial park there are actually two parts to this park on the other side of the street of where i am now is the park um with the paved roads the playground and all that the side i'm on right now is a lot more forest and a little something special right up this path. Now that something special is the beautiful farm pond that is full of swans at this moment. Um, while you are walking along the paths over here at Cushing Memorial Park, I want you guys to keep thinking and looking around at anything that really catches your eye and that you find very interesting. For me, the first thing that really caught my eye and that I find really interesting is the presence of these beautiful swans. There are at least like 15 swans, maybe 20. Walking along here, the next thing that has caught my eye and that I find interesting is what is across the pond. That is actually downtown Farmington, which is really interesting. I've now crossed the street. I'm back on the paved road side of Cushing. Um, now I'm going to walk around here and see what really catches my eye and what I find interesting. Now I'm sure our friends over at Barberry Elementary know this park pretty well already because, well, that's them right there. So the third and final thing that really caught my eye today over at Cushing Memorial Park is this. Um, this is actually the place where I went preschool uh, I did some stuff here and I did some stuff at blocks um, some of you actually might spend some time here as well walking along here I found a nice big shady tree that I'm gonna sit down and explain and do your activity all right so this activity that you're gonna be doing at wherever you chose to sit I'm over here at my shade tree you're gonna be taking all those cool things that you saw that you took note of and you're gonna be writing a story recounting your journey here at uh, Cushing Memorial Park. Um, for me, I'm gonna start my story from the second I parked my car. For you, that might be, you can choose to start at home, you can choose to start when you first got out of your car. Write a story. I have now completed my story. It's right here. It's titled Reed's Sunny Stroll. Now, when you complete your story over here at Cushing, I want you to take the story and read it out loud to whoever is with you. That might be a parent, might be a guardian, a grandparent, whoever's with you, read it to them. Now, I don't have anyone to read it to, so I'll just read it to you guys. So this is my work of art, Reed's Sunny Stroll. Today, Reed, that's me, decided to take a walk at Cushing. He parked his car at Cushing's parking lot, then walked down a ramp to Farm Pond. 
The water at Farm Pond was rippling and had many swans bathing, swimming, and eating. Next, he walked the path. Oh no! Next, he walked the path along Farm Pond and noticed that downtown Framingham was right across the pond. Reed craved food from his favorite restaurant downtown, Pho de Cao. Finally. Reed walked across the street, looking both ways of course, to the main park until he stumbled across the building where he used to go to preschool. What a throwback! Thus, Reed's sunny stroll was capped off with a bang and he got ready to go home. That is your day over here at Cushion Memorial Park all done. This park is perfect if you don't really want just the pure nature and you want more paved paths, this is it, such things like that. Now, um, I'm gonna go home. You're of course free to keep walking all you like. Remember to clean up your area after your activity. I hope you guys have a beautiful day.